Hey there everybody in YouTube land this is Tony O with Tony O's Reviews and today I'm going to review the Mr. Coffee Burr Grinder. It's an automatic grinder that you can set how many cups you want like if you want it to grind for if you're going to make a pot of coffee and you want to grind 10 cups it'll grind 10 cups you can adjust the coarseness um, it's a really good coffee grinder it's pretty nice you can dump the beans in to a big bin and it'll it'll grind them they'll stay there it's got a cover they stay pretty fresh I don't fill it up I usually just put in enough for a day or two and then uh, refill it as needed so here we go I'm gonna take you into the kitchen and take a look at the Mr. Coffee Burr Grinder okay so this is the Mr. Coffee Burr Grinder. I like that it has the reservoir for the beans. That's kind of handy. It has uh, little fingers in there that turn so the beans go down into the base. And I don't know if you can see because of that light. But that says medium and drip coffee and over on the side it says fine espresso and over here it says French press course and you turn this to the desired coarseness you want now I do wish they went ahead and had a Turkish because I'm gonna grind some here it's a little loud we go with three cups and this is handy too because if you're making a pot of coffee and you want eight cups set that for eight hit the button and it grind I don't know if it's gonna be exactly how you want it you might have to adjust it a little bit but it's pretty nice that it uh, will do some and stop so I'm gonna grind some here and we'll take a look at it <coughs> I also ordered from Amazon this baby. It's a lot better than the press that it came with. It's really heavy too. I don't know what it weighs, but I want to guess about 15 pounds. No, it's not that heavy. It's not that heavy, but you know when you pick it up, I've almost dropped it a couple of times lifting it up off the shelf. Just because I'm not ready for it to weigh that much. And I also got the milk frother cup, which I won't be using today. But it is nice metal. You can feel it getting hot when you're using it. It also came with a thermometer which uh, I haven't used just because I can it don't have to be that exact for me but I can feel it get hot in here and I know the, that the milk's still not cold I'll put links to those I got those both from Amazon put links to those down in the comments Poor shot. So I really like this grinder. Um, I do wish it got a little finer, but I think I'm going to really enjoy it. I like the all the automation. It was, I think it was $39.99 um, on Amazon. I use my uh, Keurig here. I'm making some tea right now. Make some iced tea with. This is the tea I use. This is really good tea. Um, we went to England last year and 
they were really serious about their coffee. I thought it would be all tea going to England, but they were really serious about their coffee. A lot of uh, little coffee shops, a lot of Starbucks. But this tea, I'll put a link to that too because I got that from Amazon. Um, I, you can buy it at specialty shops here, some Asian markets, but it's a little high. And uh, so I bought some from off of Amazon and there's a lot of tea. I don't remember how much it was, but um, for the price, I got a lot of tea. Like, they're big boxes. I think I got two big boxes. And uh, I went after I open them up, I dump them into a Ziploc baggie so they stay fresh. let this run a little long so I won't have to add any water to it I don't think let me taste it I'll make my yeah I'll add a little bit of water to it I'm gonna use this this will make an Americana espresso in hot water. You can add milk to it if you like. But overall, the little coffee grinder, I think I'm really going to enjoy it. It looks good beside the Jevy espresso maker. Espresso maker is still doing fine. I've been using it quite a bit over the last few days. Um, it's doing a really, really good job. I leave it on. So it stays hot. You can tell it's right there at the uh, espresso mark. Um, I drink a lot of cappuccinos for my wife. It still don't get all the way down here to the steam mark, but it gets about here, about halfway. And it's hot enough the steam light comes on when it's hot enough and it does good it makes good steam it gets plenty hot so I'm going to uh, go back to the table now there's my little setup so that was a look at the Mr. Coffee burr grinder um, also threw in some other things there the little uh, coffee press that you press into the espresso cup and the uh, frothing cup frothing pitcher um, those are real nice they weren't that expensive I'll put links to them down below um, as well as the espresso maker and the coffee grinder so if you need any of those be sure and click down below um, get them through my Amazon affiliate link and that will help support the channel uh, help me to buy more stuff to review so with that being said next video will be right up here or my last video on the uh, Jevy espresso maker and click over here be sure to subscribe I need more subscribers um, like the video I need likes leave a comment if you have a question or a comment and I'll be sure and get back to them so this is Tony O with Tony O's Reviews. Thanks for watching.